he's not your president if you're one of the illegal people, whether you're from Mexico or other places in the, in the world, like uh, Muslims and all these other factors that are coming into the United States, because we no longer have borders. So, of course, he's not your president there. And he's not your president if you're so lazy that all you're going to do is play video games all day long and smoke marijuana. He's not your president, that's for sure. So We're going to have strong, incredible borders. And people are going to come into our country, but they're going to come into our country legally. They're going to come in legally. We're going to build a wall. It's going to be built. It's not even, believe it or not, it's not even a difficult thing to do. And by the way, for the people of New Hampshire, where you have a tremendous problem with heroin and drugs, you wouldn't even believe it. You see this place and you say it's so beautiful. You have a tremendous problem. The first thing, always, that they mention to me, Mr. Trump, please do something. The drugs, the heroin, it's pouring in, and it's so cheap because there's so much of it. And the kids are getting stuck, and other people are getting stuck. We're going to end it. We're going to end it. We're going to end it at the southern border. It's going to be over. Stay chadita. Baches. We ain't got no baches. We don't need no baches. I don't have to show you any stinking baches. What would it take to build a wall on the border between the United States and Mexico? You're talking about an area 1,954 miles, stretching across California, Arizona, New Mexico, and right here in Texas, just about 100 yards away from Mexico. We spoke to civil engineers, architects, and academics. They all say the wall can be built, it can be done. The question is, how? The first thing one has to do is before you go up, you have to go down and build a foundation. This will help provide support for the wall. In order to prevent people from tunneling underneath it, it should be at least five feet deep. The second thing one must consider is what do you use to build the wall? What materials do you go after? Well, how about cinder block? The upside is it's strong, it's secure, it's readily available. The downside is it's labor intensive to have to stack every single brick in order to build the wall. So our experts say that option doesn't work. There is another option, using poured concrete on site. That's what they did when they built the Hoover Dam. The downside to that is when you pour concrete in warmer climates, like along many of these border states, experts say what you could end up with is a weaker wall because the concrete might not dry correctly, meaning a wall that could end up crumbling. So what could be the answer here? The experts that we spoke to say the way to go is pre-casted cement wall panels. Those panels would be lined side by side, sort of like what you might see on a highway. Each panel would be about 20 feet high, again, five feet below ground, about 10 feet wide and eight inches thick. Again, that wall would be stretching some 2,000 miles, and our expert says it would require 339 million cubic feet of concrete. And that's just for the panels. You're also going to need reinforced steel, at least 5 billion pounds. So what about the estimated cost? Because it hasn't been done before, let's use those highway panels as an example. They cost about $40 a square foot. That would end up costing about $10.5 billion. Sounds like a lot of money is a lot of money. But again, remember, Donald Trump says the U.S. government wouldn't end up footing the bill on this one. It would be Mexico. And what about the timing on all of this? How long would it take to build? According to our expert, if you're ambitious, you could get it done within a presidential term, four years. Baches. We ain't got no baches. We don't need no baches. I don't have to show you any stinking baches. He is going to Dwight and Forrest, uh, responsible to unknown race. The subject possibly male and female uh, of five, six unknown clothing. Do we know 
what kind of car that is. They're breaking it. Yeah, it's a 